Welcome back, it's nice to have you with us. As you can see, both sets of players outside, under the lights, warming up here at Old Trafford, and among them, Alex Tellez, a man who, of course, struggled for game time under Ole Gunnar Solskjaer, but under Ralph Ranić, he's regularly involved. He starts tonight and this week. He has to play in this team. He's the only real out-and-out goal scorer this club I've got now. You can argue Cavani as well, but he's, the lad never seems to be fit enough. But look, if, 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 if Cristiano's fit, he has to play. Mm. He's the only one. Of, he's not the only one. There's a couple more with moments of brilliance in the game, don't get me wrong. But nine times out of ten, what he's done for the last 20 years, he will keep on doing. In Europe and so is he. It's a club whose history has been written around games like this one. There's tension in the air. The atmosphere is electric. Old Trafford is special on nights like this. Well, it was vintage Ronaldo on Saturday against Tottenham United. Needed but his very best tonight against the club. Change from the first leg in terms of the Athletic Madrid shape. Ronaldo involved for the first time and keen to entertain. Challenge, such an important player for them in central midfield tonight, playing his 535th game for his hometown club. Jaden Sancho has been in fine form in recent matches. Here's the hat-trick man from the weekend. Here's Ronaldo. Breezes beyond Savic, who gets the block in Manchester United, get the first corner tonight, and that just raises the noise levels inside the stadium. They take Rafa Varan. Ronaldo. His hat trick at the weekend was the 49th of his career. He's now scored 807 goals in total. Manchester United will take one. Dallo got through Koke's challenge, he was then caught by Lodi. Advantage played here by the Slovenian referee, it's Bruno Fernandes, oh what a chance for him! Dallo leaves it for Ronaldo. Fred plays it on to Antoine Griezmann, they're not a free scoring unit. That's a foul on Ronaldo. Stefan Savic. Fred's having a very good game. Uh, I don't think it's a yellow card, I think that's a correct decision. Ronaldo's not happy. Ronaldo in on Griezmann. Crowd on that side enjoyed that one. Griezmann not doing it. Well, the big question is, was it a foul on the line? The big question was, you know, Dallow's body position. I think he got attracted to an athletical player. Inside the six-yard box, he never really opened his body up. Let's hope they can they can get a couple of goals. Yeah, the bench is going to be important. We've got players who can change a game. Potent players on the bench. They come on and influence this game. But you, you just got to be aware of what they pose on the threat list. Fourth official down below us. Ronaldo. That's where you need Cavani, I think, for now. Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes with a good ball in fraction too high for Ronaldo. Whistled across the front of him. I think Ronaldo and Harry Maguire clashed heads when they were pushing each other out of the way. Yeah, they did. What a ball. Whipped him with pace. Let's just watch this. Yeah, they did. Great spot. Left it in towards Ronaldo and O'Black read it well. Sprinted off his line. There's a good claim from the goalkeeper. Here, Here comes the yeah. apparent injury. Using the experience. Free kick whips in towards Varane. Oh, what a save, O'Black. And then the overhead kick and he saved another. Cristiano Ronaldo with the initial save. The flag's gone up against, I think, the Ronaldo follow up. But the header from Varane and the save by O'Black was top draw. What a save that is, you know, the pace on the cross from Tellez. The full-time whistle. It's disaster for Manchester United, they're out of the Champions League. Off goes Diego Simeone.